Welcome to the Creative Pugza. In this tutorial, you'll learn how to create snow in Affinity Photo. First, go to File, Open, and select the image of the mountain range you downloaded. Then, press Ctrl and J to duplicate the image and turn the original image off. We now need to desaturate this image. Click the Adjustments icon in the Layers panel and select the HSL adjustment. We want to desaturate the color in the grass. Since the grass for this pic has a lot of yellow, that's the channel we need to desaturate. Select the yellow channel. Set the saturation shift to negative 80% and the luminosity shift to 75%. Now click the adjustments icon. This time select the black and white adjustment. Increase the yellow and green. I set the yellow to 217% and the green to 227%. Then slightly increase the cyan and the blue. I set the cyan to 130% and the blue to 132%. Next, go to the Channels panel. We're going to make a selection from the black and white adjustment we added. Right click on any of the channels and click Load to Pixel Selection. The white areas are now selected and the black areas are not. From this selection, we can add white to the image to start creating the snow. In the Layers panel, click the Add Pixel Layer to add a new layer. Make sure this layer is at the top of everything. Now go to the Swatches panel. Double click on the fill color to bring up the color chooser and enter the following hex code number. FFFAFA. Then go to the Edit menu and select Fill with Primary Color to fill the pixel layer with the color we added. This is an off-white color. Press Ctrl and D to deselect. Turn the black and white adjustment layer off in the Layers panel. Label this new layer Snow Selection. If you want to add back in some of the yellows and greens, then you can make some changes to the blend ranges. Select the HSL adjustment. Then select the Blend Ranges icon in the Layers panel. To add some of the color back, slide the left point on the underlying composition ranges down to add the amount of color you want back into the image. You can also move the point on the right down to do this or even add points. In the Layers panel, click the Add Pixel Layer icon. Go to the Concrete Texture Brushes link in the description of the video. Scroll down and click the Download link. Go to the file and extract it. Then go to the Extracted File. Right click on it and select Open with Affinity Photo if it's not an Affinity Photo file. The brushes will then load into Affinity Photo. Click the pixel layer we added. Grab the paintbrush tool from the tools panel. Now go to the brushes panel. Go to the concrete brushes you downloaded. Select the Steez Concrete 1 brush. In the context toolbar, set the opacity to 50% and the flow to 80%. Take the brush and start painting on the ground area to add some snow. This will give some texture to the snow we added. Also add some snow to these parts of the land area that has little to no snow. Label this layer Ground Snow. Now go to File Open and select the image of the man. Grab the Selection Brush tool from the Tools panel. In the Context toolbar, set the mode to Add and check the Snap to Edges box. Take the brush and make a selection of the man. Press Ctrl and J to place a copy of the selection onto New Layer. Then press Ctrl and D to deselect. Copy the layer of the man and paste it onto the snow document. After that, go to the Layers panel and click the Add Pixel Layer icon. Grab the Paintbrush tool from the Tools panel. We're going to add some snow to the man. In the Context toolbar, set the opacity to 50% and the flow to 80%. Make sure the pixel layer we added is selected. Next, go to the Swatches panel and make sure the fill color is set to the off-white color we've been using for the snow. 
which is F-F-F-A-F-A. Take the brush and add some snow to the man's boots along the side of his outer pants leg and the bottom part of the pants by the boots. Also, add snow on the man's shoulders and the outer sleeve of the man's jacket. Now, add some snow to the man's hat and snowboarding glasses. Once you've done that, increase the opacity of the brush to about 85%. Then, take the brush and add some snow to the snowboard. Label this layer Snow on Man. Now we're going to add some falling snow. In the layers panel, click the add pixel layer to add a new layer. Next, go to the swatches panel and set the fill color to black. Grab the flood fill tool from the tools panel. Make sure the new layer we added is selected. Then take the tool and click on the document. With the new layer selected, go to the filters menu. Then go to noise, add noise. Set the intensity to 100%. Set it to Gaussian and check the monochromatic box. Change the blend mode to screen. Press Ctrl and J two times to duplicate the layer. Select the second duplicated layer. Select the second duplicated layer, the one at the top. Go to the filters menu. Now go to blur motion blur. Set the radius to 25 pixels and the rotation to 225 degrees. Select all three of the snow layers we just added. Press Ctrl and G to group them together. Label the group Falling Snow. And this is how to create snow in Affinity Photo. If you've enjoyed watching this video, please give it a thumbs up, comment, share, and subscribe. Also, hit the bell icon to turn on post notifications so you never miss an upload. Thank you for watching.